Good afternoon. It's actually not real late. It's not even the time I start cooking dinner or anything. But by that time, I will be busy with my family. My husband just had his um, some teeth extracted, and my daughter's basically finishing up her schoolwork, finally. Mainly finishing it up by Thursday or Friday, but that's almost over. That is great news. Because I really want to get back to, like, my channel. But I still don't have my oven yet. I'm in the process of getting another oven and refrigerator. So it's kind of hard to show some of my recipes. <coughs> Today I'm not making much of nothing big. I'm just sauteing some shrimp. Making some suddenly salad because my husband can eat this. Like kind of things that he can kind of eat. He's mainly on a liquid diet. And then some regulars. And then tomorrow I'm just making a homemade, well not homemade, last week I made a homemade, like, uh, hamburger helper thing, but this week, tomorrow, I'm so I'm not sure what I'm doing yet Wednesday, not sure if I'll actually make a recipe yet until I actually start getting my oven back, like a recipe or cook on my channel, because I do want to do that, and I have done that some, some things I've already done, some things I don't really want to do unless it's kind of unique, even though I realize some people don't know how to cook things, but anyways, that's my little spill. I'm going to try to do two videos today. One about a wine called Rascal Pinot Noir, which I thought I did, but I checked my videos. I did not do. And then the next one I'm going to do right after this, if you want to catch it. It's not going to be very long or very informative because I didn't think about it, but I made some lemongrass tea. So, and it sucks because I didn't show up beforehand. I should have, but I will talk about that later. So this is Rascal Pinot Noir Oregon Wine. Of course, Oregon uh, Pinot Noir is noble wine. It's made in 2018, and it says, Rascal sets out to create expectational Oregon wine that expires dark lovers to indulge while giving back to national and local foundations, including the Humane Society of the United States, Oregon Humane Society, and more. Our commitment to quality wine is as important as our commitment to the cause we support. So they give back to the Humane Society, and that's why they... Uh, Use the canine, the dog on there. Of course, we've got our dog, our American Bulldog. So we thought that was very good, too. And um, this was at first $20. I've never done a promo of this. This is like the third time I had this. My husband got me two bottles. They were buy one, get one free. So it was $14.99 for one bottle. So it made it $7.50 each. And that's what he got me as part of my Mother Day gift. I've already drank the other one. This one will be most likely drink today and tomorrow. Um, because I've got that lemongrass tea. So I've had it open about an hour, and I've had it sitting in this for about 30 minutes. You can definitely smell the raspberries and cherries, as you see the color. It kind of looks like it's going to be medium to full body, but sometimes the color can trick you. And I pulled out my Lilith um, wine glass that I got when I did Lilith promos quite a few times, so you'll have to check that video out. Then I realized I don't have my Norwoods, um, my Norwoods wine glass, because it got broke, or my Elusive Grape. So those two places I need to go to, but there's been so much going on in the world that that's kind of been far off my mind. Also with what was going on with me personally, if you've been watching my channel, before all this chaos started worldwide. All right. And I dressed up today because I was kind of dressed down. I only have lipstick on. I've not been wearing makeup, but maybe once a week or so, besides some lipstick. I've really not seen a point to it because I'm basically just doing schoolwork, cleaning, tutoring. I do kind of get a little bit better looking obviously when I go tutor at the park which I did have two students but now I have one and finally my some of my unemployment started coming in after two months some I say because I've actually applied for it almost two months ago so it's like and I don't know when school's starting back they're saying in fall but they don't know how that's gonna be and they say they don't know if we're gonna have a break out of worst cases I don't know I've just been trying to like stay safe and clean and healthy and stay home more. We did go to the beach last week. We are going to go to the springs this week. 
We have went to the drive-in movies a few times, but they mainly show the old movies around here, which I think I talked about. Which is okay sometimes, but we're ready to see some new movies. So, I hope things there are things to do this summer because it seems like it's going to be a long summer. How many do you got to go outside? Well, I'm going to let this sit. Remember, always take it the bottom of the stem because you don't want to touch it. And kind of also swirl it around. I'll be right back. I'm going to let my dog out to go to the restroom. Okay, Somebody's always got to be doing something. that I was using for the tea, so that'll be great when I do my next video. Had lemongrass tea before, but I've never made it myself yet. So, anyways, so now let's see. Smells like it's going to be like really berry, fruity, you know what I mean? Yeah, it's a light to medium body. Color is fooling me a little. Slight oaky, but not a lot. This talks about having oak notes, but I don't taste it a lot, which is good. So I don't really like that. It's very good. It's not my favorite Pinot, but I do like Oregon Pinot Noirs. There are some of my ones that I tend to go to. That are California. It would definitely be good with certain foods, too. Don't know if it's going to be good with what I had tonight, but possibly so. Well, remember, part of your purchase for this Rascal Pinot Noir goes to the Dog Humane Society of the United States and Oregon and more. And it's a nice, it's got the Purity Award, too. Oh, and it even has the little United States with all the different animals. I don't know if you can see that. But for Florida, it looks like it's a dolphin. It's pretty cool. So definitely give it a try. Might as well try it in these times while you have more time. Maybe some of you went back to work. That's a blessing. Hopefully you're starting to get your unemployment and all that good stuff. And just stay safe.